So in this video I'm going to show you how I make this background for my Mac without using any Photoshop uh, at all. It's just a simple kind of camera trick that anybody can do and in fact I'm going to do it just now with my iPod uh, just now so you can see how it's done. It's just a simple case of taking the photo over and over uh, after you've imported it again. So what I've done is I've just taken a photo of my whole screen and I'm going to open up Adobe Lightroom and import the photo into Lightroom. Once I've imported it, I'm actually just going to crop it a little bit just so it's just showing the actual screen and not the bits around it. But other than that, I think that's pretty good. And I'm going to also make the well, the, the outside of the actual display in the Lightroom. Uh, I've got it as medium grey. can change that around, but I'm going to stay, stay with uh, medium, medium grey. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to now take a picture of this picture in the uh, Adobe Lightroom develop module. And what I want to do is I want to get a bit of the grey around the side as well. So I'm going to make sure I get all that in and uh, then we can crop it just after. In fact, I'll get, get all the crap below. And then I'm just going to import that photo as well. So uh, again, bring it into the develop. I'm just going to crop in some of the crap at the top, and that should be fine there. And I'm now going to take a picture of that picture. So you should be starting to see how it's slowly developing here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut, do this again about three, four, five times. Uh, let's just see, bring it up just so I can see where it says image at the bottom there, and just where it brings in the file, edit, develop, and all that kind of stuff at the top. And I see that looks pretty good. So again, take another photo of that now. Okay, so there you go. That's uh, effectively what I've done to get this uh, photo. So now I'm just going to go export it and uh, then I'm going to set it as my background image. So if we go here, so currently my background image is just a single shot of this. Go to exported images, right click, set as background. So there you go. My computer screen is now my computer screen and in my computer screen and my computer screen and my computer screen. Again, what I would say is you can definitely do this a lot uh, more accurately and a lot better if you're doing it with a proper camera and you're setting all the exposure, maybe on a tripod and you're setting all the focus and all that kind of stuff here quickly with an iPod taking pictures of your screen. But I uh, thought you might find that interesting. Maybe uh, give it for yourself and let's see your cool ones as well. Maybe doing a rotating one as well. Equally as cool. Okay, hope that helps. Bye-bye. One last thing is that if you are on my photography channel, you may not know that I've got two other channels. One is my exercise channel, which you can check out, which is Don Bauer Exercise. Uh, I think the actual name is just youtube.com forward slash Don Bauer. And I've also got another one on this channel. Uh, so this is, I've got Dom's Talks. And a lot of that is going to be about well, me dealing with my first ever newborn baby, uh, little Logan Bauer. Uh, born on the 4th of September, uh, and so I'm, I'm learning to be a dad. So it's all my mistakes and all the things which I'm learning which are quite useful. So if you want to see more about little Logan and how he's getting on, check out Dom's talks. And if you want to see, oh, I've also got Dom's flights as well. So uh, again, I'm doing a lot of stuff flying my DJI Phantom uh, around the places uh, and also going through the, the process of getting the, li the license to do it commercially. So if you want to see how I'm doing that, check out the Dom's Flights channel as well. I should put all the links to down below. So thanks for watching. Bye-bye.